this week on NXT, two major things happened. Yeah, that's right. Two major things happened. They're mainly good and they're mainly bad. Reading your guys' comments right now, uh, y'all want to start with the bad news. Okay, let's start with the bad news. Wesley is injured. And oh, that hurts to say. That hurts to say. Wesley is injured. And if you don't know how, which is shocking because, you know, you're supposed to watch NXT. Uh, Wesley suffered a back injury that will take him out for eight months to a year. Which is the long time. Which is a long time. Because I fucking love Wesley, man. Like Wesley is my favorite NXT superstar right now. And the fact that he got injured, like, that sucks. And he's no longer going to be at deadline to take on Dominic for the North American title. Which upsets me, bro, because I feel like Wesley could have won it. Like, that would have been his time to win it again. But nope. Nope, his back injury caused it. His back injury happened, and we're not seeing the match. Instead, we're seeing Dragon Lee versus Dominic Mysterio. And now I know that Dominic's not going to lose it. <laughs> I know for a fact he's not going to lose it. And, oh, bro, like, the fact that Dominic is still North American champion actually kind of pisses me off. Like, I'm not even saying that because he's a good heel or, like, anything like that. It just gets me irked that he's still a North American champion, but he he's a Raw superstar. Like, that actually just irks me. Like, we have way more contenders for the North American champion. Dominic hasn't done jack shit with it. Like, dude, the fact that he's still the North American champion bugs me like i'm still bugged when trick williams lost it in three days he literally could have had his time bro the fact that he lost it in three days is fucking fear infuriating and he's still the north american champion he's not even part of the nxt roster bro like what stupid shit is that dude if i'm Shawn michaels i'm literally booking that shit like yo we gotta make this kid lose it immediately. He don't need no title. Get him, just let him stay on Raw. Let him face Gunther, get his chops in, you know? But no, we're still here in the predicament that Dominic is still the North American champion. Oh, the cursed North American title, man. It's it's crazy, it's crazy. But back to Wesley. Wesley is gonna be gone for a while and it sucks. I love Wesley, but I wish him a speedy recovery because back injuries can be serious, you know? You, get, you take bumps on your back, like, the fact that he's gonna be gone, he's gonna be gone to like the end of twenty. Like he's probably gonna return sometime like around October or November twenty twenty four, which is crazy, bro. Like twenty twenty four, we're not gonna even see Wesley at all. But I wish Wesley a speedy recovery, bro, because it just sucked. And I love Wesley, like I legit do. He's my favorite NXT superstar, and the fact that he's not even gonna get a shot for the North American title is, is mind blowing. And he defeated three former North American champions. Bronson Reed, Johnny Gargano, and Cameron Grimes. Like, he did that, and he proved that he belongs in NXT, and he proved that he should win the North American title, but nope. Once once Wesley comes back, oh, it's GG's. He, bro, he's going to be a superstar. He's going to be a big talent. He's going to be a, a top-tier superstar. I can guarantee you that. And also, I was also looking in the comments on Wesley's promo, because I was like, wait, what's happening? Because at first, out of context, I didn't know what was happening. When Wesley was cutting a promo and he was, like, shedding tears, I was like, wait, what's happening? It Like, is he injured? Like, what happened? And I was reading the comments, bro, and, yo, I was a little, I was a little salty. I was a little salty, like, saltier than the fucking ocean. People are complaining that Wesley, like, yo, wrestlers are so soft nowadays, or why is this dude crying? This looks so awkward. Yo, Wesley had an injury, bro, and he was going to probably win that title not probably he was gonna win that title and now he can't even have the chance because he's injured for eight months to a year if you're a, a wrestler and that's a lot of time because you can only do the shit once you know you're aging and you're gonna miss that much you, well, imagine what you could have done from eight months to a year you could have done so much but you have to it slowed down you know and people who saying he's a crybaby bro it's okay to let out your emotions, you know? It's okay to show your emotions. It doesn't... Who, who gives a fuck who is going to comment that shit? You got to show your emotions, you know? Men can show emotion. Not, it's not just women, man. Men can show their emotion. Nothing wrong with that. 
But still, man, let men show their emotions. I think it's it's not it's not silly. It's just it's a man, you know. It's manly to do that shit. Leslie's injured. I'm sad about it. And Dominic being the North American champion actually still kind of pisses me off. But now that we're done with the bad news, it's time to move on to the good news. And oh my god, this is the biggest news. Nikita Lyons returned to NXT. <laughs> yes, yes. Nikita Lyons is now back on NXT. And if you don't know where she was, many people are like, oh, she's slacking off. Or she she's just doing, like, she's an OnlyFans thought. No, 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 no. She got, she also got injured. She returned from an injury actually that tore her ACL and other shits. Uh, I don't I don't know what else she tore, but the ma major thing I know is she tore her ACL and she was also gone from the company for 8 months to a year, the same time frame as Wesley being out. Nikita Lyons is back and I said it before in my older video Nikita Lyons is going to be a future star. I can guarantee you that. Nikita Lyons has that look. Nikita Lyons has the look, the mood. She has everything. To me, Nikita Lyons is going to be the future star for the women's division. Like, once the four horsewomen are retired, and once, like, five years in, Nikita Lyons is going to be that star. And, dude, and you can say I'm wrong. Dude, even Shawn Michaels said it. I don't know how accurate that tweet is, but Shawn Michaels even said himself, Nikita Lyons has that it factor and i agree with Shawn michaels you know one of my favorite wrestlers of all time i don't disagree on that like nikita lyons bro i'm now excited to see what she does and i'm, I'm saying this right now i'm calling this 2024 nxt women's champion nxt women's champion she's gonna be the nxt women's champion i'm calling it right now once i saw her return on instagram i also looked at the comments seeing how the fans feel about this because i feel i thought they would have been happy about it you know like Nikita Lyons was such such like a big attraction for NXT. I thought people would have been on board with it. But it turns out there were more there was more negativity than positivity for Nikita Lyons to come back. And I'm like, yo, what is happening? First Wesley gets called out for being a baby, and now Nikita Lyons is getting hate? What? It doesn't make sense. I legit don't know why she's getting hate. But from reading the comments, it seems like She's like a Nia Jax 2.0. I don't know where people got that. Like Nikita Lyons has never legitimately hurt someone in the ring. Not that I know of. Like I think she's 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 great in the ring. Like it takes time to improve. Like she may be a little rusty. You know, she may be a little little iffy on the ring. But with improvement, she could be really good. Like I think like I I don't think I know she's going to be a star. And the fact that people just call her out for saying like, oh, she's finally back after just posting like bikini videos or her twerking all the time. Like, dude, she was gone for a knee injury. Like, do you not know why she was gone? That Nia Jax comment actually kind of irked me a little bit because she's nowhere near Nia Jax. Like, Nia Jax legitimately hurts people and I don't think she's safe in the ring. Nikita Lyons, she looks safe in the ring. And who and the people who hate on Nikita Lyons, bro, I'm going to find your IP address. On God, I'm going to find your IP address because I will not stand for this hate. And I know there's going to be a few people, a few people being like, oh, you're just a simp. Uh, she's not really that good. You just think she's attractive. Uh, yeah, she's attractive. I also think she's going to be a great star for the company. Like, she's great looking. She's attractive. And she also got the cake. She has the cake industry on her, actually. But that doesn't take away that she's not talented. I legitimately think she's talented. Like, dude, five years from now, bro, if she doesn't screw up with anything, I think she could be a main eventer for the roster. Like, for the main roster, she could be a main eventer. I I'm saying that right now. It takes time to improve. Like, there's so many wrestlers that were really, like, boring and not caring. And now look at them now. Like, they just skyrocketed to the main event scene. I'm excited for Nikita Lines to come back you know i can't wait to see what she does in nxt i i missed her so much you know i've been keeping up with her on instagram because you know i'm i'm a nikita lions simp lord like i would i will get on my knees for her i would let her, let her do anything to me nikita lions is gonna be a main event star and she has that look i'm on god on god but i think that's really it you know wesley is injured which is which sucks and now nikita lions is back which is a w but that's really it. That's really it for what I thought about NXT. But that is all for today. Thank you all for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed it, 
Make sure you guys give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and turn on post notifications if you haven't to know when I upload a new video. And make sure you guys follow my Instagram down in the description. You know, every follower counts, please. Like, I just need followers. I'm down bad for followers, please. Like, uh, like, I'm down bad for followers. But thank you all for watching, and I'll see y'all later.